Hi there. Thanks for tuning in to make this happen, where you discuss an idea we've been dying to see come alive. Every week, my friend Jay... That's me. <laughs> <Just us. laughs> and my friend... Oh, wait. And me will bring yourself... It's me, J. Yee. <laughs> <laughs> you never knew you needed. Now let's get started with business cards. I have a bunch of business cards. I collected a bunch of business cards. Um, the, the the original card game to collect, the business cards. Yeah, yeah, sure. For for adults. The original adult trading card game from the TCG Corporation, you know. Uh, Wizard is what they're called. Wizard made business cards. They make all the business cards for every businessman out there. Um but wouldn't okay so here's the thing when you meet someone new let's say you just got a new job like i did we're not a new job but a new place with a bunch of new people and you need to exchange numbers you know what in the old days we'd hand each other business cards but nowadays we have phones and we're like let me get your info what if there was a way just to do like what's your info well here's my phone Bam, it's like Apple Pay. It's like a wallet. And then just saves all their contact information that they want. Like you have to set it up like a profile in your like Android or like on iPhone. It would be under like uh kind of like the wallet page. It'd probably be under the wallet page. You just add this. Right, right. And then um, you know, like when you put something over each other, like if you put Apple Pay or Samsung Pay or whatever over something that takes it, it automatically opens it up. Yeah. Uh, that'll happen when you put like two people's phones on top of each other and then maybe you'd have to double click to activate the wallet so it doesn't happen when you just have two people's phones so on top of each other. So what if it's not your back to their screen but it's their your back to their back. So when they so mm. when the phones feel back to back that's when it does it cuz sure. you could stack phones back to screen pretty easily. Yeah. But back to back happens much more rarer. Yeah. Of an yeah. occurrence. So maybe you go like this. Nice to meet you. Ching. Definitely. And it has smartwatch capabilities, but yeah, it's just an, it's just so an it, app. So so if you shake if you do a left handed shake, if you're right handed, that means you want to exchange information. Because that's bringing your watches together. What if and no, I, what I if, want also there to be an AI voice saying Alex has met J Yi. I I would love that. But what if it's more like we invent the new way to greet each other. You know how like during the pandemic, the new way to greet each other, uh, each other was the fist bump. That became the new thing. We, yeah, or elbow bump. Yeah, or the elbow bump. But now that what we create is the, the smart watch pump. <laughs> There's like, oh, so what's your name? Jay. Oh, what's your name? Alex. Nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you. Boom. <laughs> Just hit the smart watch. And together. then you could, you could sit there and decide what you want to share. Do you want to share PSN profiles, Snapchats, mm, mm. Instagrams, phone numbers? Maybe you only exchange emails like in uh, popular visual novels. Which one do you want to do? Yeah. Maybe it's like the, in the app, it's like, these are the things that will be transferred. And then it's like, it'll have things like if the recipient wants your like PSN, it'll transfer over but if or they LinkedIn don't profile what if you're networking yeah but it's like it's like let's say you're just meeting a random person and they like psn what's that no i don't want that so if you link and you have your psn it won't show on theirs because they didn't mm -hmm. tap accept on that you know what i mean and maybe with some apps we make it further integrated so obviously it goes straight into your contacts list right but maybe playstation we make a deal with playstation and uh, are like, hey, give us access to your app, and then just, it'll just add the friend, right, like that. Uh, or the Microsoft, I don't know how Microsoft does it, but the Xbox friends list thing, we work with Microsoft and do that, and then you get add friends like that, you know, Steam, all that stuff. Discord, there we go, there we go. Yeah, Skype. and you could, you could add whatever you want, that way your friends list grows big, and... Um... It grows easily and you don't have to ask anybody for anything except for the initial time where you're like, hey, would you like to exchange information? Yeah. Yeah. And then you just. And if you think oh, about it, it's well, even it's better be like... for dating, too, because no one has to give fake information. Yeah. You could just. Um, you could give a throwaway. There's like two options. <laughs> like, you just. You when hit, when you you're hit on a throwaway option the first time, and then it's like, huh? 
you're on a blind date for the first time and they're like, so can I get your information? And you're like, and you see the girl like, yeah, sure. They press a little button on the top right. You're like, damn it. Ding. <laughs> yeah. you like, you know, it's their throwaway. Yeah. And you're yeah. like, it's okay. The new way people greet each other. Oh yeah. Uh, so can I get your info? Uh, yeah. Do you have tap, uh, tap con, con tap? And they're like, Oh yeah, I have con tap, con tap. I don't even know what I just said. Con like, yeah. And then they hit it. We're like, oh no, I don't. But like, oh, man, well, okay, take out your phone. Well, you should really get this app, you know, it makes this a lot easier. And con tap can also be the new way to sign for packages. Mm. Yeah. It'll yeah, be your it digital signature. Yeah, digital signature and right there. You'll just have to have facial recognition or put in a password for using con tap. That way someone doesn't like mug you like hit you in the back of the head take your phone then go on a spending spree as you like they take your identity yeah yeah well i mean you could only like fill out information and sign stuff with it you can't there's no credit card information stored that's true that's true yeah but i like it um what else do you think we could add to this i think with contap you can, I think it can be the place for all of your digital information. And I think based off, you know what I'm worried about with Contap? What's that? You know, those things where Apple, like where a really nice app comes out for Apple and Apple's like, that should just be a feature of our phone. Mm -hmm. And then it becomes a feature of the phone. Like, do you remember when flashlight apps were a thing? Oh yeah. And then yeah. Apple's like, we should make a flashlight. And then that just happened, and then flashlight apps disappeared. Well, that's definitely going to happen. This product, when we say whoever make this happen, it's either going to be Apple or Microsoft. And if it's not, it's going to be some tech, and then we're going to either be bought out by Microsoft, and then Apple's going to make their own. I think another feature is sharing a calendar with somebody. So if you're like, yeah, I mean, just find a spot. And because I know that's how my company works. Is they're like, if you want to have a meeting with me, look at my calendar and put a spot, and we'll have a meeting. And I'm mm. like, like a business account type of thing, like a business contact. And then there's like a separate account. That's just business yeah. stuff. Yeah. I like that. I like that. Um, I also think another issue will be like spam for like self promotion. Obviously you could mark which ones you want on and off, but it's like you ever go to like a girl's Instagram page or something or Twitter page. And it's just, Here's my links tree. Here's my OnlyFans. Here's my Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat. Yeah. Da, 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 da. It's like if this you tap and then all of a sudden it like follows you on every single one of their social medias, you know? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I could see that. Or being a it thing. makes you subscribe to mailing lists. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, you have to turn all that shit off. Go through all your settings, even the ones you never heard of, either look it up or just say no. Right, right, right. I wonder if there's going to be ways where it's like, you can either pay five bucks to get in or just slide your phone to contact all these booths. And it's like different things that you contact and then you just sell your information away. <laughs> yeah, I could see a lot of problematics happening. But that's not our problem. That's the consumers. There's a big terms and conditions that they had to press accept. Just don't, to. just don't tap on things you don't want to tap. Don't, yeah, don't give your yeah. information away for free. Don't don't go do the mag charging station in a place that's a little shady. It's a random coffee shop that you've never seen before that week, and it just all of a sudden showed up, and there's a mag safe wireless charging port. Probably don't use it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Got to protect your stuff. And uh, and what? from now you'll hear from our sponsors, uh, Express VPN. <laughs> I wish. Right. Hey, do you guys like Netflix and other places? <laughs> I've heard enough of them. Now, how about Athletic Greens? I thought you were going to make a reference to the We Are Not Game Desk game we just created last Friday. Oh. That we recorded wow. today. I'm talking about when this episode comes out and people hear this. When I say last Friday, that's when the Netflix game just came out, Alex. That's right. Think about how star time standard. works. Yeah, the star standard, the game that we talked about three days ago, remember? 
the game we just created. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right, yeah. You're three right. days ago, not not about thirty minutes, ten minutes ago. That's true. Although we do put brackets on when everything's recorded. That is true. That is true we that we do that. that. We do do that. <laughs> we we let people know. We let the people know. Yeah. Right now we're recording, just in case a fan wants to crash our recording sessions. That is true. What what do you think? Microsoft, Apple, King, Tencent? Not Tencent. Oh, uh, well, well, no. I mean, I think Tencent might like this. Now that I'm thinking about it, a nation that would want all the social contacts in one portfolio and then learn where you're sharing your social contacts to learn your circle so yeah. that they can better understand your circle and make sure that you're graded well on your circle and then maybe deny you access if you're not going to the right places and sharing your stuff. I think 10 cents at home right there. How about the CCP for this one? In all, fact, I probably can't go to China anymore. Now that I shared that. All of that stuff. All in a very cute mini game that's in this app. Just a super with a really cute nice mini game. with a new with a new. Um, it's like tap everything. You are with, in a you're in the grocery store, Seven Eleven. Tap this little thing, and then you get these points, and you get <laughs> discounts too. Yeah, and then yeah. I just imagine there being a really cute uh, mascot. Ni hao ma, is this coming up? Tencent, make this happen. Thanks for listening. If you have any suggestions or products you'd like to see talked about, feel free to write in at adpoundgames at gmail.com. We have a Patreon. If you'd like to join the AdPound family, come find us at patreon.com slash wearenotgamedevs. Patreon receives episodes two days early, meaning make this happen, gets to your ears that much sooner. If you enjoyed our show, take a second to give us a review. We're on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Google Play Store, and more. Catch you guys next Sunday with Alex's idea. Underwear. Have we done underwear yet? Perhaps, but at this moment, I don't think so. We should, instead of contact, we should name it Nihau. Sure. Yeah, I like that. Nihau. If it's made by Tencent, it makes sense. It's saying hi. It's a new way to say hi. Tapping your phones yeah. or smartwatch. Right? Started. Right? Thank Nihau. you. Nihau. A new way to say hi. Man, you know, propaganda's probably worked that we're sitting here making Chinese products. When it comes to America, <laughs> it's just called Hello. Hello. Apple's gonna call theirs Hello World. And then Japan, oh hi. Short for oh hi y'all. Yeah, I like it. Wow. This is We create we created a monster. <laughs> yeah we did <laughs> this is the one where <laughs> you, you know those articles that are like creators J.E. and Alex Gonzalez never wanted their product to be used this way <laughs>